And hello again, everybody. Mark Mannering here from Class Training with another three tips in three minutes, more or less. And I call this Google Browsing Using Your Cloud Apps Better, the sequel. We covered some of this in the last uh, session with uh, how to set up some tabs that come up automatically and how to download stuff a bit better. And here are some great tips that I use a lot, three more that you can use. One of my favorites is how to zoom in and out of any uh, program in particular, but we're going to use Google Chrome here. And all we do, as some of you have heard, is we just go control. So we hold down the control key and roll the wheel on our mouse back and forth. So I'm just rolling it away from me on the screen. You can see rolling it back towards me and it's zooming in and zooming out. I call it control and roll. Some of you heard me say that. So instead of going control plus on the keyboard or whatever, I just go control and roll. And she zooms in and out. Okay, our second big tip is something you might have done before, and that's what we call the bookmarks across the top there in the bookmarks bar or the so-called favorites in Internet Explorer. And all I need to do is go to a page that I want to come back to a lot. And two ways to do it, to bookmark this page, you can click the star in the top right-hand corner here, and I'll just click that, and up pops a, a little menu. I'll close that off. The other way is a keyboard shortcut, Control-D, to drop the page you're looking at onto the bookmarks bar. And when it comes up, you can type in a name. If I know how to spell correctly, that'd be good, wouldn't it? This is live television almost. So you type in the name of the particular page. Now, underneath, there's a folder. I've already got some folders set up. And all I want to do is just put it onto the bookmarks bar itself, not into any subfolder. And I'll show you that in a sec. I click that and I go done. And off to the right there is my shortcut. There's some other folders I've set up. So if I click uh, on web resources here, I can uh, sub uh, organize those, put those into a sub folder so I can add more and more without clogging up the page or the screen. So that's called the bookmarks bar across there. And if you don't see that, if it's not showing, you can go to the three dots menu here and click that. And we can come down to bookmarks here to say show the bookmarks bar if it's not being shown. This one here is important, the bookmark manager. So I can click on that and I come to a bit of a list, a bit of a folder list almost. And this is where I can rename, move around and do a lot more with uh, bookmarks. OK, and the last tip here is uh, something you've probably done before as well. Very common this, where you search through Google for images you might be looking at. I don't want to give the game away here, but uh, I've just looked for happy people on computers. And there's a whole range of uh, images there. Now, when you go to copy one of these, make sure you bring them up. Make sure you actually display the full image. Don't just go from the thumbnail that was in the list there. Wait till the whole thing comes up so you can see that it's nice and clear. Then use the usual shortcut you've probably used before where I just point to it, go right click, and I can say, uh, save the image as to my desktop or keep it um, permanently, or just copy the image so I can uh, cut and paste, put that into my Word document, PowerPoint presentation, whatever it might be. And that's it from me for this time around, a real quick and easy one, uh, this one. So don't forget, number one, use control and roll to zoom in and out of your Google browser and in fact, nearly any Windows package. Number two was to use bookmarks a bit better and manage those. And then number three, make sure you display the actual image, not just the thumbnail when you right click and uh, download it for yourselves. Uh, Mark Mannering here signing off. Make sure to check our website for stuff coming up and we'll see you again next time. Thanks a lot. Bye.